Hi everyone, this is Brad. Today we're taking a look at how to use Google Slides to create stop motion animation using a water cycle. So what I did here is I just typed in water cycle images and then what you want to do is go to tools and then color. You want to make sure it's transparent. Now I found a picture and I downloaded it. So what I want to do now is I want to go into layout and I want to make sure it's blank. Now I'm going to do a background. I'm going to use that image that I just downloaded and I believe it's called water cycle. Let's see it here. Here it is. And select open. Give it a little time to load. Now, what you'll need to do is just select done. And what we want to do is we want to insert a text box. So what we're going to do, we're going to start right down in here and we're just going to call, we're going to type in here, uh, let's go evaporation and we're going to size wise, let's do 36. Might be too big. Yeah, a little bit, but we'll just stretch it out a little bit. Okay, so here's evaporation. Now, what you need to do for the stop motion animation is just duplicate the slide and then go in and move this up a little bit. And each time you duplicate, just keep moving it up. And then when you're ready and you take it up to the cloud up here, change it into condensation and then precipitation and then runoff. Now, I've already created one just to show you what it looks like. And it looks like uh, looks like this right here it went through and it was 57 slides so you could preview it by selecting one and then going through and seeing it go through but the best way to do this is to go ahead in and file publish to the web and then what you want to do is you want to change it from every three seconds to every second start it as soon as a player loads restart it select publish select ok now, what you want to do for this one is Control C, copy it. Now, come up here, paste it in. But what you want to do, instead of a thousand, make it say a hundred at the end. Give it a little bit of time. And here it is ready to go. And you can see it's going through the slides and going through it. And it's easy to go ahead and share. Another way what you could do is go into something called Tall Tweets. Tall Tweets, as long as you link it to your Google account, you can go ahead and choose the uh, presentation and then what you want to do is go ahead and make it about 1200 slide durations you want to do about 0.2 or 0.1 something like that and then what you want to do is say select create gif or create gif and what it'll look like it'll look like this right here you can go ahead and tweet it or you could just come right in here right click save image as and you can see it's just called download one select save and there it is so there you go. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.